What up, y'all? It's your boy, Yo Blizz, and I am back with another one. Now, this one is about Respect Life. Um, As we all know, the current situation with Melo is still unknown. Okay, guys? Um, As far as we know, there is some type of mental instability going on. Like, and he's not well enough for the show. Okay, that's all we know. Um... But I like to talk about a few different things right now pertaining to that as well as the show. Um, Mellow. Now, as far as Mellow goes, we haven't seen Mellow. I'm hoping that he's getting some help and that he's getting better at this point. I'm, I have him in my prayers and I'm wishing him well. I wish the cast well. I wish everyone affiliated with that great show well now let's get beyond that the show is back if you guys don't know there have been three different episodes already released um a few different things that i've noticed about the show one of the things and i'll point that out is uh like the power factor Okay, uh, there's a situation where the sister, Mello's sister, she was actually gunned down in one of the episodes by Hefe, and he headshotted her and left her for dead in that apartment. I actually have the clip here. She's back. Now, not to say that that's, you know, I'm just pointing it out. Just in case you were a little confused and you said, well, what the, I could vaguely remember her, something happening to her. It did, and you were correct. Um, as far as, as far as the um, situation with that, I'm comparing it to power. I'm comparing it to uh, a lot of other shows that have done that. You see, where Kanan came back to life after he was killed. Okay, guys? Now, the problem with it is there is no backstory and there's no mystery behind it. What happened, what actually happened to her. We know that she got headshot by a killer who wasn't going to leave without her breathing. Okay? With, with her breathing, pretty much. I said that backwards. Hefe, in that show, is a ruthless animal and he cannot be contained the only way to contain this man is to kill him very smooth suave and he gets it done now he's been taking some l's and he's back with the vengeance in the new episodes okay uh and i i, I believe they've gotten some get back i don't want to spoil that for you guys that haven't seen the show so make sure you check it out make sure you check out that's my favorite web series ever. Like, I literally, literally have watched tons of them. And this one was the most captivating to me. This one always kept me intrigued. It always kept me on a cliff. And I've been waiting to see the next show. Now, this last few months, it's actually been kind of dry as far as Respect Life. We haven't seen Respect Life. And it's been kind of slow release-wise. 
So, you know, I've reached out to Ty. I've spoken to him a couple of times in the inbox. Um, just pretty much regular chit chat, not getting too in depth about the family business. I've already done enough and I already know enough. I've let you guys in on something that they probably tried to keep secret, but it was going to be, it was going to be a, a time for it to come out. Unfortunately, guys, you get what I'm saying? I don't mean to be the guy that made it a thing. What I'll say is I'm hoping to be the guy that brought a lot of good energy to the situation and people's prayers and blessings for him. That's what I'll say. Um, the show, kind of slow. We got, uh, I forget some of the characters' names. Uh, what's his name? G died. Uh, the guy that was, what is his name? That was uh, running the, the clothing store. The guy that was running the clothing store. I, it was right on the tip of my tongue just now. And just, boom, it's gone again. Well, Chase is back. That's the sister's ex-boyfriend. And he is, he wants his bread. You remember the book bag that he lost? He wants his bread. He's not playing. He's ready to knock somebody's head off. Your boy, you know his body, you know his style. He's under pressure. He really can't deal with the pressure, so he's plotting it out. He's looking for a little help. You got, uh, damn, it's, it's, it's a lot going on. Like I said, guys, I don't want to spoil it for you at all. I want you guys to get a chance to enjoy the show yourselves. But there, there were things that I did want to point out, like the fact that she died and there should have been some type of backstory with that. That would have extended the episode some as well. You know, so things of that nature, um, people are going to notice for sure. They're going to notice for sure. She definitely got clipped by Hefe. But we'll see what her role brings. They definitely need a character. They're, they're down a character. So I want to see. And I'm curious about what... It's going to happen as far as her role. I can see some growth in her role based on Melo's current situation. Guys, this is your boy, Yo Blizz. Make sure you like, comment, and subscribe. Don't forget to hit that bell notification so that you get my updates on a regular. Make sure you check me out. My other stories. Check out the music. This channel is a channel. It will be treated like a channel with different shows coming on throughout the day, guys. Make sure you... Check them all out. You might be intrigued by more than just my news. Peace.